But what's up, y'all? I am Drew Landy. Welcome back to Liberty Flames Dynasty. And today, we have long-time rivals. Because in order for it to be a rivalry, we have to, like, beat them. We have not beaten them. The closest we've gotten was our very first episode. Um, that was a long time ago, and we lost because of a safety. Y'all already know the story. Uh, but today is the first time I truly believe we have a chance to beat them, okay? Uh, we're coming off a 73-23 to 23 win. Uh, best of all time. Uh, most points we've ever scored. Best all-around game. Of course, it was against FCS. So, look at that. We are number one in points scored per game. Number one against the Rush. Look at that. Fifth for the pass and whatnot. Uh, LSU, they lost their first game. Kind of a surprise. Yeah, Tanny Harris was a beast. For sure. Um, yeah, they're their top players. Yikes. Um, so, uh, yeah, we'll see how today, today's game um, goes. I really do think we have a chance. Um, really like our team. Um, we are a little bit senior heavy. Uh, I was just going through the depth chart. Like, we have a lot. A lot of seniors. Uh, we do have a lot of freshmen. And we do have a lot of um, like freshman sophomore, but also a lot of redshirt players. So, that's good. <laughs> that's really good. All right, here we go. We are home wearing the all reds. Last time we were home against uh, LSU, they smoked us. <laughs> so here we are today. Pageantry. I don't know how there's pageantry, but there's LSU. But either way, they choose tails. It is tails. So I assume we will get the ball first. We shall. Taking to the best kick returner. One of the most dangerous individuals in all of college football. Will not get a chance to return the ball here. Terrence Barber. Um, yeah, three touchdown, return touchdowns. That was last season. And this season, he has one? Maybe two? I'm not sure, but. All right, here we go. Tom Smith taking the field. Danny Harris. Terrence Barber, of course, is now our third receiver. Um, and really rightfully so. And who is this guy? He's so fast. <laughs> Still gets four in the play. Danny Harris. I sorry, last week, 144, three touchdowns. Such a steady force on offense. Um, I'm pretty sure he's almost already our, our like all-time leader in everything. And I'm going to take off and run here, pick up a few yards, step out of bounds, first down. Just like that, seven yards. And yeah, I have probably way too much uh, <laughs> confidence in today's game. Like, like this is LSU. And I'm actually more worried about their offense and their defense. Um, we've always been able to put up like some kind of points. It's always been about our defense just being able to make stops. Um, I think, you know, two, the last two games, I, I don't remember if we made much of any stops. So, All right, here we go. Smith, back to throw. Deitches, who oh, tries to make a man miss, did not work. Brings up a second down and two. And yeah, Corey Deitches is such a weapon. To play action fake here in second two. I like that quite a bit. Uh, I think Ramirez go deep here. Got two receivers going deep. Got him again. What a throw as he gets hit. Deitches stiff arms a man to the 10 yard line. 33 yard catch. What a throw under pressure. Tom Smith got hit. Couldn't even finish his throw. The follow through. What a catch. Corey Deitches breaks a tackle. Just like that, we are in LSU, not only LSU territory, but like the red zone. Yeah, this is not, ooh, like great play there. <laughs> My, the, the lineman just, no resistance whatsoever. Yeah, we're showing LSU, hey, we are no longer the pushover we used to be. Yeah, maybe we got, we, well, we, we definitely got lucky that first year. That's going to become the norm, okay? We're, we're no longer the baby brother we're just a little brother now at third and five from the five i'm gonna screen pass here was that smart i'm almost gonna say yes it looks like they're gonna blitz they do blitz he gets it off can he beat him to the end zone yes he will danny harris touchdown on the screen pass who throws more screens than us nobody they should have seen it coming they didn't we score we go up six nothing soon to be seven nothing and we have the lead on LSU. Can you believe it? 
Kind of, yes. This is the opening opening touchdown. So ah, that feels good. It makes us all feel good. Here's Alves with the kick. They will down it. Yeah, Alves is his last. We have so many seniors, like Rusty Browning senior, like so many seniors. Ah, it's just wild. We have just too many seniors to be honest. I don't think we're gonna take a step back next year. I just don't think we're gonna take any, take any steps forward. Oh, I didn't even see him. I gotta be honest. I thought that was an offensive lineman. <laughs> Looks like an offensive lineman. Um, yeah, zone defense, honestly, for our team has just been absolutely terrible. Although now that we are a little bit faster and better now. We got a triple option. Oh, we got it covered up. But nobody's there. Keyshawn Hunter, who had the record for sacks last week. It was like five or six. Uh, versus FCS just absolutely destroyed their offensive line. Um, they make a play on that on that pass, but you know, on that play, but he was he was there. Oh, another read option. Rusty Browning slows him down long enough for Steve Young to clean up the mess. First down. TJ Finley. And yeah, this is this is about right. This is what happens. <laughs> Our defense went from allowing huge gash plays to now well they still allow gash plays. It was a very strange play. And my goodness, hello? Boy Moore, first down. Yikes. As I said, this is where I'm most scared. Let's, can our can our defense make a stop? So far the answer is no. Billy, Ethan West. How come I get tripped up? But when I dive at their ankles, nothing happens. Come on now. Come on now. Come on now. I'm gonna turn down the Indian volume just slightly. I think that's a little bit too loud. Alright. There's no blitz here. Oh man, what a blitz pickup. I go for the hit stick again. I need to stop. I need to stop with the head sticks. They literally don't do anything, okay? I miss more than I connect. So, 7 6, they tied up right away. Drive right back down. Take the lead. I mean, what can you do? <laughs> what can you do? Alright. Will we get a kick return this time? No, we gotta play it safe. This is the LSU, okay? I don't know why I said we had zero touchdowns. For his, what's his name last year? But we definitely did. All right, Terrence Barber in the slot. I'm looking at him. I love having him as a slot receiver. He's just so fast. That was a horrific pass. Way too far outside. Wow, thank goodness that was just in no man's land because that was like that was bad. Quick throw, Terrence Barber. Stays in bounds. Able to pick up an extra couple yards, but. Takes a big hit in the process. Um, he's just too dynamic um, a player to just not give him chances to touch the ball. Um, this is why we put him as our slot receiver, third receiver. Um, I mean, he's, he's everything you want. Quick throw, Pedro Brooks. First down, Pedro, the speed man, as we named him last year. Ten-yard catch right there. Have to respect the speed. Okay, from on the outside, him, Patrick Ramirez. Um... Building blocks for sure. Patrick Ramirez, of course, a junior this year. It's crazy. Like, you remember when we first had him? Ah, oh, now he's a he's a junior. Wild. Pedro Brooks, of course, a sophomore. And will we get to play off? We will not. So that will do it for the first quarter. Seven to seven. Um, yeah, of course, we are killing the ball, trying to take away as many possessions from them as possible, keep our defense off the field as long as possible. Until our defense really improves enough for us to be competent on the defense, i trying to concentrate. On what I said. Until our defense is competent, we pretty much have to play this way. My problem with that is if we can't get first downs, we have to rely on our defense, and that's just a scary notion. Quick throw. We're not going to pick this up. Oh, Terrence Barber hangs on but takes a huge hit. Ooh, decisions, decisions. Fourth and three. From the 47. I'm going to go for this. Am I crazy? 
Yes. Yes, I am. I'm watching Deitches here. He should be able to beat him on the inside. Who does not? The outside. Let's go. What a throw to Greg Doug. Wow. Great throw. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Throw of the day, Tom Smith. Crossbody over all kinds of traffic. Wow. Right on the money to Greg Doug. And then Harris could not get going at all. I mean, I like Tom Smith. They have four rushes for one yard. Um, yeah, they get they make us one dimensional. That makes it a whole lot tougher. Quick throw, Pedro Brooks on the outside makes the catch first down. On the curl route. I mean, for them, I mean, they they have to respect the deep pass. I mean, yeah, with Mirrors and Brooks on the outside, I mean, they, they have to give them cushion. They are two of the fastest receivers in the country. And man, even with space, Danny Harris just does not have the speed. And Danny Harris is here. He's not a senior. No, he's a junior. He's a junior. Here's Terrence Barber. Oh my goodness. He has taken huge hit after huge hit. First down. Damn. LSU is just headhunting right now. And us killing the clock is, is, is working right here. They actually fake. Oh, wide open. Corey Dyke just. Oh, I thought he hit the spin button. Apparently not. First and goal. And is he down? You know? Not sure. All right, Cordish. Yeah, five for seventy-five. He's been our main target so far. I mean, he's just a mismatch. And there's a reason. Like he's, I think he's our leading receiver this year. He gets a lot of touches. Oh, Danny Harris, and just, there's no chance. Man, still picks up like two or three, but it doesn't matter. He was injured, so he's gonna return soon. Um, who's your backup? Norman. Yeah, Carl Norman, sophomore uh, transfer. Not as fast. I don't know what to do. That's fine. Throw it away. I don't mean to throw it away. Uh, we'll keep him in. He's he's going to be very useful right here. Um, so we got Patrick Ramirez on the outside. Gonna watch him. Watch Deitches. Watch Barber. Deitches again. Oh, we got dives. Touchdown. Let's go. We take the lead again. Corey Deitches. My goodness, he is a junior, I believe. I think he's a junior. So we have him for one more year even after this. Which is like absolutely insane. But uh, we love it. So his love is on the kick. And will he return this or will he kneel it? Oh, he will take a knee. Oh my goodness, back-to-back -to -back touchbacks. Does not happen uh, much at all. All right. Rusty Browning. One of our best players really came in day one. We got everything locked up. Yeah, Steve Young <gasps> picks it off. Inbounds. Let's go. The user pick. Cole Wilson takes it away. Was beat to the outside, but the speed got back. Got the foot down. We take control, and we have a chance to go up two scores on LSU going into halftime. Well, recovery by Cole Wilson. Pedro Brooks was just so fast off the jump there. Dyke just able to make that catch. My goodness. Yes. Huge hit after huge hit uh, in this game. <laughs> Alright, we are we are content with running this clock a little bit. Our possession needs to be, I mean, one of the last possessions. We're gonna roll out. Oh, hold on. I get this to him. Let's go. Here's Barbara drops the ball. Drops, people, drops. If it was not for drops, our team would be a lot better. All right, third and six from the 33. This is four down territory, in my opinion. So I'm going to screen pass. Try to make four down more manageable. Oh, we're, we might pick this up right here. Please connect all your blocks. First down, let's go. Oh, what is the flag? What is the flag? Oh, that's killer. Third and 18? Oh. All right. Well, they're they're gonna call timeout no matter what. Um, yeah. Let's see forward. Let's see what they do on the outside with Ramirez and all that. <sighs> nothing. I have nothing. So I just took the sack. 
Man, I, I maybe had Ramirez down the sideline. I just, I just, I just didn't trust myself. All right. In them deep. Oh, great punt. Get down, get down and bounce. Yes, what a punt. Let's go. Good job, Alves. Pins them at the 10 yard line. I mean, about as good as you could ask for. All right. Ethan West, not Emmanuel West, like Alton for like the whole series at this point. Yeah, everything locked up. So short, short catch, that's fine. Second and five, I assume that they're going to hurry up. Or they may not. Are they content to run this to uh, halftime? Because I sure would be. I sure would be. All right, second and five. And... I'm, I'd be surprised. Really? They're going to run this down? Well, hey, make some noise. We are up 14-7 to 7 going into halftime against LSU. Who, who would have thought we'd be here? Um, not us. They are going to throw here, which, again, doesn't make any sense. We're going to bring him down for the sack. Jimmy Gonzalez getting a free sack, pretty much. And we go into halftime. 14-7 to 7, up on LSU. LSU is in trouble right now. Elvis with the kick. I just realized we will have the win in the fourth quarter, which could be very important uh, for us. Yeah, we have a sack. That was kind of a free sack uh, for the most part, so not too not not too impressive. <laughs> uh, we did have that interception though. Wow, that was that was huge. All right, so here we go. Here's Williams. Man. Gash. Josh Williams gets eight on the play. Sit down in two. Spread. Oh, run right up the middle. Got him. Third down. Let's go. Cole Wilson having a great game on defense. Big tackle for loss there. I wonder Robert. I'm going to pinch or a press on the outside. Pinch on the inside. I'm gonna bring up Skipper. Oh, it's a, oh, it's a read option. They got me so bad. Great play call. Great play call. Man, I always fall for those read options, like without fail. It is the most frustrating. Okay. I'm just gonna take the goats and to the outside, and we got contained at least. Only picking up a couple. Gain of three. Josh Williams. Okay. That's why I focus so much on the quarterback, waiting for the <laughs> him to keep the ball and just take it off running. Right, I'm going to show Blitz here. Pinch the line. I'm going to take the Ethan West. The only three down linemen, so if they run, we're in trouble. Which it looks like they're about to. He's going to come in. There's a simple option. And off to Rivers. First down. Eesh. So LSU uh, moving the ball right down the field. I mean, no... Resistance, no nothing. Yes, yes, yes. West. Protect Josh Williams. And uh, I was ready for it. I just got chop blocked. That is crazy. I mean, we should make the quarterback keep it. I mean, he's not as like dangerous as the running back. I guess. I'm gonna take Rusty Brown in here. He's our superstar strong safety. Another great option. Let's go. Ethan West there for the stop. Only a gain of two. And yeah, they're doing what teams should do against us. Just run the ball every single play. Um, well, we maybe will stop them here and there for a little stop. Here's the throw. It slants. Blitz rush in. Somebody rush in. Fumble! Was that a fumble? Or did it just go to like a weird camera angle for no reason? The way it went, it looked like it was a fumble. Am I wrong? I don't know. Either way, it's first down 10. Uh, I'm going to show Blitz here, bring him up. Not a Blitz. You got everyone covered except for you on the outside. First and goal, LS LSU. Well, so much for our lead that we just had. It's about to uh, evaporate. Uh, we'll take Rusty Brown in here. Oh, I was looking for the read option. I was ready for the quarterback to keep it. Touchdown, Josh Williams. And, well, just like that, 
Tansu has tied it up again. So, not a waste of an interception, but I mean, it does give us the like possession lead. Like we have possession with a tie game. That's that's really all it kind of does. My goodness, I'm gonna return this. Um, was that a wise decision? No, <laughs> not at all. Not at all. No need to be selfish. Just take what is given to you. That's, that's the lesson of the day. And this is a very interesting formation. Get the block on the outside. You too. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Just glitching, flying all over the place. Thought I had a lane to the outside. And all of a sudden, like, the dude just, like, glitched, like, forward. Like, Wreck it, Ralph. What's going on? Oh, man, I just, just no, nowhere to roam with Danny Harris. He's making us one dimensional, and I just don't like it. I don't like it one bit. They have three down linemen. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna run this ball right here. Oh, come on, get over, get over, get over, get over. I forgot we still have the two clock on Danny Harris. What a tackle! I have to punt. I, I can't go for it here. Fourth and one? Like, ah. Oh, no, that's too far to the outside. Ah. Uh, still like a 40-yard punt, but... Not a good punt. Not a good punt. And our offense has faltered on these past couple of drives. Yeah, we scored to make it 14 to 7 at one point. And you know, our defense is not too bad right now. It's just their situational defense, our situation is not good. Too many third down conversions. Um, too many, like, just big plays. We don't need to allow the big play. Man, I'm going to guess pass here. You know, it could be a draw. I'm going to watch that. And uh, I so many people to cover. First down. Great play call. Predicted pass. Was a pass. Yeah, just wide open. And my goodness, who is covering him? Apparently nobody. <laughs> nobody was covering him. Yikes. Alright, here we go. Wide open. Who? Oh, points for his six first down. Trey Bradford. And yeah, LSU's gonna march march down and probably take the lead. You no, know, they really have not tried to go deep. Everything's been underneath. Okay, until I see this guy, yeah. I see, oh my goodness, what a hit! Let's go, Ethan West. But still a first down. Tayshawn Boot. First down, it's probably Boutte. Oh, oh. Big skipper. Let's see Brown and do his thing. A guard in case he gets beat deep, which he did. Let's oh, screen pass, screen pass, screen pass. Oh, we got the sack, let's go! <coughs> All of it. Keyshawn Hunter, let's go. Superstar, well, easiest sack of his life. <laughs> Somehow not the ball goes. Somehow did not fumble. Second down, 21. This would be a huge, huge stop. I should have pinched the line. And we got a run here. Oh, triple option. Rusty Brown to make that tackle. Does not, but Skipper cleans it up. Third down and 11. This is a huge play right here. I'm going to go cover four. I'm going to pinch the line. I'm going to back off everybody. I'm going to assume it's some sort of short run. Or short, uh, short pass. Only looking for the sticks. Oh, it's a screen pass. Great play call. Is anybody there? Nobody. First down. Oh, my goodness. How many yards is he going to carry Ethan West for? Oh, all of them, apparently. Great play call. We backed off so much. Damn. That's a great play call. Steve Young here. Steve Young cannot bring down Finley. My goodness, no one can bring down Finley. It's going to be second down a goal on the other side of the third quarter break. So start of the fourth quarter. We are tied. Um, we just cannot. It's really been our running game that has not been able to get going, which has killed us so far. And clutch skill has been activated. I have not seen that before. I don't like that, <laughs> to be honest. 
Oh, turn, turn around. What a throw. What a catch. Touchdown, James Rivers. And LSU has taken the lead. Huge. Man. Man, huge play. Huge play. It's frustrating. Nine plays, 56 yards. I mean, yeah. Sounds about right. <laughs> they just they just took their time. They were patient. And Ball State takes down Indiana. Which is fine at this point. Um, so, man, we are in danger of losing to LSU. We will take this out with Terrence Barber. A little bit more deliberate here. Bad decision. When, when will I learn not to do that? It's about right. It's about right. <laughs> Oh, yeah, we have not done a read option all game so far, so they shouldn't be expecting this. No, we have to kill clock. We, we, we don't need that on our own. Oh, Danny Harris on his longest carry of the game gets seven. And yes, you heard that right. That is our longest carry of the game. I believe it. Ten for twenty-one. Yeah, they have just not allowed. And then on the left, I guess I guess it is their right. Tom Smith's going to have to try to outrun everybody to the first down marker. He does. First down slides safely past the 25 to the 26. And we are in business. Big first down there. That first that first, first down on the drive. It's obviously the most important. It gives you that confidence. Dangerous throw to Patrick Ramirez, but he gets the first down. Yeah, we do not have many total yards in this game at all. Um, after last game's just offensive explosion, but a defensive struggle uh, so far today, and really more of a struggle for us. And Corey Deitches, big catch after big catch, and if 13, is quickly becoming a safety blanket. Um, it really has been the best tight end for us all this entire series. Um, I know Zach Fouts, we love Zach Fouts, but um, yeah, Corey Deitches for sure better than Zach Fouts. I mean, look at this. He is just killing LSU underneath. Nine for 108 and a touchdown. Like, whoo! Alright, if we can somehow get to the outside here, get that block. Man, they are just all over Danny Harris. I mean, if, if they came in, they said they will not let Danny Harris beat us. Which is a wise thing to say. Um, this, is, this is four down territory right here. Fourth down. I mean, we don't, we don't know how many more chances we'll have to get it. We got our first down. Let's go, Dan Harris. Moving the pile. Big third down conversion there. Hmm. If you do these empty sticks, it's just whoever beats their man is getting the ball. Greg Doug, Dyches, Brooks on the outside. Dude, nobody beat their man this time. Except for X, but I don't want to throw it to him. Throw it away. I don't want to force anything. Don't want to try to scramble, run. And Loki Tom Smith has played... Nearly perfect. I almost didn't want to say anything. Because now I'm like, he's going to pick or fumble or do something incredibly um, Smithian. Green pass on second down. They say coming, maybe. Oh, great spin move by Danny Harris. Danny Harris inside the 10, inside the 5. Gain of 30. Let's go. So needed. Danny Harris on that screen. And let's watch this spin move. Woo! Dude is grasping at air. That deserves a couple carries to try to tie this baby back up. Harris up the middle. Ooh. Is met at the goal line. I thought about diving in there, but... Yeah. We made the right decision not to do that. Um, try another dive. I really think we just give it to Danny Harris. All four, all four downs, to be honest. Well, I like this matchup right here. We should get it. And we do. Touchdown, Danny Harris. We have tied it up against LSU. Have we ever been tied versus LSU in the fourth quarter? Definitely not. Definitely not. Defense. Can you make a stop? To be honest, if we can hold them to a field goal, I will be ecstatic. The really goal is here, just no touchdowns. There should be a touchback, so they won't have a chance for a return. Of course, now that our, like, pickoff unit is, like, decent. Yep, they down it. 
All right, defense. Can we get a stop? I mean, this this is the game right here. If our defense makes a stop, I mean, our offense is good enough. We should win this game, which would be incredible to be LSU. Oh, Ethan West, everybody went after him. This is, this is the opposite of what we needed. First down. We had that locked up. I don't understand why everybody just ran right past Josh Josh Williams. <sighs> Frustrating, without a doubt. There, uh, we'll play zone defense with, with Ronnie Wise. Oh, screen pass, screen pass to the outside. And Butte, my goodness, takes a huge hit. It's me second down and five. Still picks up four, or picks up five. Okay, TJ Finley has been perfect other than the interception, which was an incredible play by Cole Wilson. And yeah, we need our cornerbacks to develop and develop fast. Go to the outside. Nobody's there. Incomplete. Third down and five. And here we go. Here we go. Push everybody up. I'm going to assume it's going to be a pass play. I'm going to guess pass. Because I want every sort of advantage. It could be a run play. It's a screen pass. So it's a screen pass. Keisha Hunter brings him down. Loses two. It's fourth down and seven. I'm assuming they will punt. From the 42. Yeah, it's way too risky. Let's go. They're going to punt to Terrence Barber. Who has not really had a fair shot today to return a ball. Until right now. Will they try to pin us? Punt out of bounds? Will they just launch it into the end zone, which may be their best course of action? Um, they're going to let the clock drip. Which is, Loki, not the best idea. At this, at this point, time is not... I mean, it, it's definitely on our side, but why are you trying to kill the clock right now? It doesn't, it does not make sense to me. And Barber's going to let this one go. And good decision. All right. Here we go. A drive. To be LSU. We need to go. Probably. At least 55 yards. Which is no small task. I do not have anybody open. Oh I have B open. I see him now. Oh but Tom Smith is speedy. Steps out of bounds. First down. Gain of 11. Huge. Uh, I don't even think LaMarcus Jussel. Could make uh, that throw to. Uh, what's his name? Down the right sideline. Uh, -wee. Which, but by the way, if you like Lamar, if you like uh, Road to Glory, don't forget to like and subscribe because you we upload this like every day. There's an upload, um, and two three times a week. I he's wide open. I was too busy talking, but Tom Smith's still gonna get another huge first down. Yeah, like and subscribe uh, for more content like this. I mean, this is intense right now. This is the year. If you're ever gonna like, if you're ever gonna subscribe, it's right now. Okay, because Liberty is on the rise. We're about to take over. Okay, the Mac. Did I potentially miss a bigger play thrown to Dicious? Probably. Okay. But it's worth it. Yeah, we got nobody. They knew where all the things were. I'm just going to throw this away. And make sure I get out of the tackle box so it's not intentional grounding. I already made that mistake first. LSU with a chance to win or tie the game. We're going to screen here. It looks like they're blitzing. They are. Danny Harris. There is nobody within 20 yards of Danny Harris. 20, 15, 10, 5. Danny Harris is... A fumble? What is this garbage? No, 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 no. What just happened? Okay. Yeah, huge return. Yep, 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 yep. Do not tell me he fumbled right here. How did he fumble? You're telling me this guy reached over, punched the ball out. You got to be kidding me. Every time we have a chance to be LSU, something garbage happens. Wow. Screen pass. We got locked up. Take a seat. Keyshawn Hunter, the leader of the defense. He and Rusty Browning for sure are, are the leaders. Uh, 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 uh. Reset, reset, reset. Yeah, we said no. We we were ready for that screen pass that time. 
We were all over the running back, winning for the interception, everything. Oh, they may try to run this ball. I'm going to wait to see what they do here, and then I'll call timeout. Keyshawn, do not jump off sides. Not what we need right now. Come on, be loud. Be loud. I'm trying to pump up the crowd. Oh, they are going to throw the ball. I'm so confused at what they chose to do there. And out of bounds. Stops the clock. Let's go. Third down and 12. That could be to their advantage. I'm not honestly not quite sure about that. But All right. Um, we need to do two men under. I don't want to pinch because it's too easy. All right. Come on. Huge, huge play. They are going to run a screen. What is it with them running screens? We got this one locked up. He has stopped. Timeout. We're going to get the ball right back. Even after Danny Harris somehow fumbles at the goal line. I, st I still can't believe that, by the way. I still can't believe that, by the way. Like, how? <laughs> Absolutely insane. All right. Terrence Barber. Chance to return. Oh, my goodness. Oh, good block there. Oh, Terrence Barber. Weaving in and out of traffic. 14-yard return. 56 seconds. We're at the 49-yard line. We need uh, probably 25 yards. Mary Kicker does not have the best kick power. All right, here we go. Smith, back to throw. Danny Harris. Uh, we're going to let the clock run a little bit right here. Because if we don't get the field goal, we don't want to give them any time either. Uh, that's probably not the right decision. Probably not the right decision. I probably shouldn't have done that. That's okay. That's okay. We have two timeouts. All we need is field goal. We don't need to score a touchdown. Why is Terrence Barber looking like, like not lined up correctly? Throw it away. Oh, <gasps> no! What is this game? LSU is the luckiest team on the face of this planet. Tried to... Ugh. Are you kidding me? A pick six? You talk about a swing. We were supposed to be up. We're supposed to be up right now. 28 to 21. Man. Well, now we have to score a touchdown. Oh, I can't believe this. I did, uh. Wow. Just, I, I don't know what to say. <laughs> Every time we face LSU, there's some sort of hullabaloo, and we just need a sack. Throw the ball away. Let go of the ball. Don't have to waste the time out. Tom Smith, come on. Put our team in position to win. And they just can't get there. Man, I thought we had it this time. I really thought we had it this time. Yeah, bomb it up deep. Interception. That's game. That's so frustrating. We had the victory. We had to get cheesed out because of the fumble. And then the garbage interception pick six. <sighs> I can't believe this. All right, well, I'm like sick. <laughs> I I can't. You you cannot make you cannot make this stuff up. You cannot make this stuff up. We have two. We had two chances to win. One we should have at least. We should at least be playing in overtime right now. All right, twenty-one, twenty-eight, two six six, two touchdowns, two picks. One was garbage. I know they both were. They were just yeah. Danny Harris, fourteen twenty-nine, could not get going at all. They played great defense. They made us one-dimensional. Um, Deitches, yeah, 9 for 108, which really invisible like at near the end of the game there. Dan Harris, 5 for uh, 92. Should have had a touchdown, two touchdowns, not just one. Um, but, man. I mean, LSU, they were better. They, they should have won. But, like, why do we have to lose like that? I can't... Uh. All right, well, let's go to uh, recruiting and see if, see if, uh, y'all, I am like distraught right now. I cannot believe this, but all right, let's go to recruiting. All right, let's go over recruiting. Obviously nothing in quarterbacks. We have enough. Uh, Drew Mc, McDougal. Uh, we are obviously in the lead. Uh, 
Um, hopefully he should uh, get his visit uh, fairly soon. Uh, no fullbacks. Receivers. William Williams. What a name. Um, oh, 97 speed. I forgot about that. Uh, we're in lead over him and Jonathan Glover also with the lead. And he is lackluster. What was his catch in this guy? 61. All right. That's, that's better than what we've seen in the past. Uh, looking at some guards. Lead for Zach Huggins. And we have leads on these guys, even though we have like, no interest in them. Uh, Jared Mullins have lead. Why do we have this guy on here? No, thank you. So lots of leads, even though we're really doing nothing. Xavier Jacobs. We scout this guy? We have Robert Fitch. Uh, we do need some defensive tackles. Middle linebackers. Holy cow, why do we have so many? Dave Moses. Um, we are so far behind. I really want to invest in them. Something I'm going to probably lose out on. So no, I'm going to take him off my board. And um, I know he's the best one. Have we, have we scouted all these guys? Oh, he's got like none of these guys. How, how's this guy? Alright, fine with that. We'll, we'll invest in this guy. Here we go. Boom. We'll, we'll give it a shot. Uh, cornerbacks, nothing. <laughs> uh, free safeties, uh, I'm going after these guys, and we're not going to go either of these guys. Uh, I'm going to take off Jarrett Vandermeulen. Uh, yeah, yeah, we don't have a chance. <laughs> anyway, but uh, Gary Daniel, uh, that's a little bit more. We'll, we'll, we'll give it another week or two, see what happens. Uh, strong safety, have the lead, and we're just down a little bit on Chris Lane. Hunters. Still in, still in there. Um, this is okay. Yeah, I'm almost like, is it worth even go after? I think it is. Uh, athletes, we're, we're barely in on some of these guys. We're number two there. How? I don't know. Is, is it worth it trying to stand on these, on these guys? I'm not sure. Well, not as good as I would have liked, but we do have UTEP coming up next. And hey, I'm ready for. Yeah, we have some time to recover as we hit the road against UTEP. What do you mean we have some time to recover after that heartbreak, heart-wrenching, frustrating loss? But we're going to get some revenge against UTEP. We've never lost against UTEP. That's where, of course, uh, old coach Thomas Gill is coaching, which they've already lost. They lost 41-14 to last week, so, yeah, we are, we are ready. Man, I can't believe that. But anyway, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe right down below. Uh, you can do that to see more content like this uh, like every single day, okay? Uh, I upload this uh, series uh, twice a week. Uh, Lamar Shussle, uh, Lego Star Wars, uh, and more. And if there's something you want to see, put it right down in the comments. Uh, if, I, if I can do it, I'll get to it. Thank you all for watching. I am Drew Landy, and I will see you next time.